Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here and today I have a quick layout to share with you using one of my hip kits. Um, I chose this picture of my parents' beagle. <laughs> He's um, He was laying on my husband's lap and he bit people a lot as a puppy. Like he just, he had issues. But this one, he was just kind of biting my husband's finger and he had this kind of crazy look on his face and it was just really funny. So um, I took this picture of it. So this picture is like, uh, probably two years old, um, but or at least over a year old, but I wanted to make sure and capture it and scrapbook it. So um, I, whenever I first um, mat, yeah, whenever I was first matting this photo on this green and black paper, I believe it's from We Are Memory Keepers. Um, when I was first doing that, I cut it too short on one side, which is always a danger of gluing and then cutting your paper so um I had to redo it and it went the writing is now sideways but you really cannot tell at all so and then I chose this black and white diagonal stripe which I totally love and um whenever I accidentally cut that little strip off and it was too short I, re I really actually liked it and um, the back side of it is that bright lime green which normally is not my favorite color, but I happen to really like it. And um, I was trying to bring back some of that green that's in the paper um, that I matted the photo on. And then, of course, there's a darker green color in my on my husband's shirt, which is kind of the background of the photo. So um, I was just trying to bring the greens in on this layout. Greens I find to be so hard to work with even though I do like some shades of green. Um, and green is actually like one of my favorite colors, but it's hard to find shades of green that I like to work with. Um, so I was trying to use up some scraps as well, just some pieces that I had um, left from the last layout that I did using my hip kit. So I just cut a little square of it off and matted the photo with this. And then I had some pink paper that I was also matting the photo with, which I believe is the back of that craft paper, I think. Um, so I feel like I'm not as good at, at layering photos as I want to be, but I am really trying. <laughs> so yeah, bringing in that pink and then I cut it too short but I do like it like that, so I'm going to go ahead and tear it down. And this is where my tape runs out, of course. And I can never refill my tape on my own. I just, I hate, that's the only thing I don't like about the Scotch tape gun. So here I am passing it off to my husband and finding a tape refill. And hopefully he will be able to fix it for me in a timely manner. I don't know what I'm doing now. Maybe I went in the other room to get him. I don't know. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> um, so I didn't really have a huge plan with this layout. I just really knew that I wanted to use this picture of my parents' beagle and that I wanted to um, use that green and black and white paper um, just because I thought the green kind of went with the theme of green on my husband's shirt. So, yeah. So decided on the place for the photo and this really is such a simple quick layout my layouts have not been that stellar lately um I just I don't know I need to switch it up or something there's one layout that I have to share with you guys that I absolutely totally love um and I'll be sharing that soon but I haven't got the video ready for you guys yet but for now I'm just playing around with these puffy stickers from Maggie Holmes and I was trying to make this little embellishment cluster and it wasn't really working I think even though I really love the placement of that chipboard ribbon piece and the the chipboard heart it just left me like with a little awkward space over there to try to embellish with um so I was doing what I could with what I had um so and then I'm just trying to bring in a few more of these green pieces that were in the hip kit that month I think this is the March kit. I'm 99% positive this is the March kit, but I had got the March and the April kits at the same time, so I might have been confusing them a little bit. This 
This, I'm pretty sure, is from the April kit. I was trying to keep the kits separate, but I figured, hey, I have all of them. And I'm, it's not like I'm on a design team or anything where I need to use just one kit. So I'm just going to spell out my title, which says Crazy Beagle, because he's just got this, like, strange look on his face. And he's sitting there biting someone. I don't know. He's just a crazy beagle. He, he really is. Um, and then I'm going to, what am I going to do? I don't know. But those chipboard letters, I think they're from Amy Tangerine's new collection. And um, they are super sticky. And I love the silver stripe line. So, um, yeah, I thought they were just awesome thickers. And then I'm going to use some cork hearts on this layout. And that's pretty much going to wrap it up. Like I said, super simple layout. But I just wanted to share it with you guys because I just try to share everything that I'm doing with you guys. So that's pretty much going to wrap it up. If you want to see a photo of this, make sure and check me out on Instagram because I will have a photo over there. And yeah, I'm just trying to get those stickers really stuck down so I don't have to use glue. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a great day.